Hey guys, welcome back to another installation video and today I'm going to be installing PMA Siren Sync on your server. Now this resource will replace Lux Vehicle Control. This was a resource created by Berkey. His information will be in the description below and also the link to the GitHub repository PMA Siren Sync. To install this, the first thing you're going to want to do is open up the description and go to the link PMA Siren Sync. That's a GitHub link. If you don't want to do that, go to Google and type in PMA Siren Sync for 5M. And then once you're at the GitHub page, don't click the code download button. Don't do that. Go to releases 1.01 .01 or whatever version you see and go ahead and click .zip. Now this will download the .zip file for you. And once you have this, don't close the tab just yet. Just minimize it and we'll come back to it for references later. But go ahead and go to your download folder and open up PMA Siren Sync. Then what you're going to want to do is go to your resource folder for your server, whether that's with Cubicore, ESX, or Overextended. Now for the video, I'm using the Cubicore and I'm in my standalone folder. I'm going to drag PMA Siren Sync into my standalone folder. And the reason I'm doing that is because if we go to our server.cfg here, now the reason I've done that is because I already have in my server.cfg ensure standalone. And so what this does is starts every single folder in my standalone folder without me having to type anything extra. If you don't have this, then you're going to want to do ensure PMA siren sync. And if you don't know how to spell that, and if you don't have it, and you don't know how to do it, it'll be in the description below and you could simply copy and paste it. But for the video, I already have it in my standalone, so we'll just go ahead and get rid of that. Then what we're going to want to do is go ahead and close your .zip file and then you can close your download tab or minimize it and then just go ahead and start your 5M server. So now that we're in our server, we're going to go ahead and spawn a non-ELS vehicle and I'm going to go ahead and do that now. The reason we didn't close the GitHub link is because we're going to go back and read the readme to see which keys do which functions. So in the readme, it states you can toggle the emergency lights by pressing Q on your keyboard. So we're going to go ahead and try that now. Lights turn on, lights turn off by pressing Q on your keyboard. That is quite essentially what it's doing. If we go back to the readme, it also says you have a few ways of controlling the sirens. The first way is to hold R on your keyboard. That doesn't require the emergency lights to be on. The second way is to press comma on your keyboard to toggle the sound and press it again to untoggle. This one requires the emergency lights to be on. The third way is to press the up arrow key on your keyboard. This will toggle the second sound on your vehicle. If it doesn't have a second sound, this will do the same as pressing comma, but without the emergency lights requirement. So we're gonna go ahead and do that now. So we're gonna press R. As you can see, it said that the lights don't have to be on for this, and we hear the sound. Then what we're gonna do is we're gonna turn on our lights by pressing Q and pressing the comma key on our keyboard. As you can see, we have sound coming from that. Now, if you press comma again, you will cycle through the siren pattern and then eventually it will turn off. Then if we press the up arrow key, there is our second sound and it just turns off. Then we go back to the GitHub page and then it also says the horn for your emergency vehicle is also replaced by this resource and the key has not been changed from the default E key button. That means that the E key is still going to be your air horn for the police vehicles. Now if you found this installation video helpful, give the video a like, subscribe to the channel, and if you're curious about this Dodge Demon behind me, go ahead and join my Discord. More information about that is in my Discord server, uh, visa the Dodge Demon channel. And I'll see you all in the next video.